What's up, y'all? Got a film on the feet, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Young Miami New Man is Stefan Diggs. Offset being messy. Cardi denies she's back with Offset. Let's get it. Young Miami having a new man because Saucy Santana posted some messages between him and Young Miami. And in the messages, Young Miami was basically saying that she has a new man. And some people feel like this new man is NFL player Stefan Diggs. Now, there's another rumor going around feel like that, that Cardi B cheated on Offset with this same NFL player. Oh. Because I just saw you at a football I, game, girl. That nigga threw oh ball. Goodness, I don't know me, baby. This is not about me, girl. This is about you. I'm just saying. You done got me a whole hour and some interrogate me. It's your time. Is you dating? Girl, you look good at that game, girl. I that girl, I miss this. Jersey all that like. Stop trying to hide it. Don't put that nigga jersey on. Tell her how we do. For real, make them hoes mad. Oh my God, man, Tia just walking up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and if that nigga don't stand on business, Yanti coming for his ass. Oh, I gotta put you on his ass. So, he better burkin', he better burkin' all that. So, so Yanti knew or know who he is, huh? Uh huh. Oh, now I see. She at the game. Okay. Yeah, he for the girl. He for the turn. They up. always tell on themselves when they go to them games. Like, oh, I forgot. He put the clothes on now. I don't know. want it. He don't want this. It's here. I'm going to hook you up with one of the friends. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. So Stefan Diggs play for the Houston Texans, and as you guys can see, the person that is behind a young Miami has on a Houston Texans jersey, and the other person I think they have on an Atlanta Falcons jersey. So a lot of people felt like she was there supporting her man. That watch even crazy. Even. Tia Kemp said the same thing. So a lot of people feel like Young Miami's new man is Stefan Diggs. But you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on that. So moving on to the next topic. Offset decided to be messy yesterday and go live inside of Cardi B's studio. And a lot of people are like, well, we knew this was a PR stunt. They're back so together. he went live in her studio. I thought she showed a total different studio. But look, he's live inside of her studio, and Cardi B did respond to that. We spend so much money on studio time in the city, but don't get it twisted. I got a insane studio at home. It's huge. My oh, the now I see. So much They're back together. Look, he's... Oh, I see the top now. So much money. That absolutely did not look like that. On studio time in the city, but don't get it twisted. I got a insane studio at home. It's huge. My booth is over there. The light combinations are mad ugly, but I don't know how to work them, so get over it. Hey, we have it. What's up, Twan? Cut the light on, cut the light on. Yeah, man, I just want to let y'all know we haven't, we haven't. Oh, we haven't now I see. Kid. I didn't see this. I'm going about it. Though, y'all live with that. Yeah, we have it. You saw your baby father in your studio. Uh, he was at your studio. So is it this? Is it that? I think y'all need to understand, like. I think I need to understand. We do have two cribs. One is in Atlanta, one is here. But we've been living with each other for years now. We've been living with each other for years. The Atlanta house, there's no clothes, there's no nothing. Only one person lived there. Only one person lived there. Everything is here. The whole, everything, the adjustments, everything is here. Slowly but surely, everybody got to go their separate ways. Slowly but surely, my kids got to get used to that. No, you're not going to come home every single day and your, and your dad is not going to, it's going to be here. Slowly but surely, it, it's kind of hard. I, I don't even want to talk about it because I don't want to get emotional, but it's kind of hard when like, okay, as an adult, you, you're going to get used to a, a certain type of uh, a certain type of lifestyle without being with somebody but it's also kind of hard for your kids to get used to that so it's she ain't going away she ain't going away I need to listen to it she not going away like slowly but surely we're gonna that has to happen 
Your dad is not going to be here every day or two after school. Your dad is not going to be picking you up after school. I want my baby to know who their dad is because I don't ever want my little baby to like get used to like my dad or get used to like my 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 cousin. I'm sorry. <laughs> I want them to be like this your dad, but slowly but surely, everything just has to stop. One thing I don't want to entertain is uh. Oh, we're in the same crib. Come upstairs. Let's sleep together. I don't want to entertain that. I don't want to sleep. I don't want to. I don't want nothing because that's what keeps us being in the same trap and the same trap. And it's like, oh, we sleep together. We cuddling. The next day we're smiling. And then so she's over here running in Paris. Okay, <laughs> she ain't gonna be able to run too long. That gonna get back and and she gonna see him. Honey, so I told me not to have them clothes right there. She gonna see him, she's gonna melt, and it's gonna be a wrap again. And guess what? The same day we arguing and then we back in in that, we back in back in that cycle. I don't want that cycle. That's why I don't even I'm not entertaining love, I'm not entertaining the kissing, I'm not entertaining like, hey, hey, come upstairs. Oh, this and that. No. That's why if I'm here, I'm not here. If I'm if if I'm here, he's not here. Oh, so when one come in, the other one leave. I just feel as though they got too much money to even play that game. Because who would have been had their own spot? What you mean? I'm going to be at my other house. I, by the time we divorce or whatever, we could just go ahead and sell this one, figure everything out. But I'm, I'm not going to be here. I'm going to be my other house. But slowly but surely, it's going to be a, a whole end to it. But it's weird. It's, it's not weird. It's just like, it takes time. And I don't even under, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. But every So somebody said, that man said, you my baby mama on one. Ed Carter B, why is that man in your house? Where is the boundaries that you are setting for a woman that knows her worth? And Carter B responded and said, I think y'all forget that I have a newborn that's three weeks old. Trust we not playing house, we are done. But my baby ain't going to be no B word neither. Also, slowly but surely. Hello. Because, I mean, come on now. If she, if she don't allow him to see the kids and all that, then it's really going to be a problem. It's, they These celebrities will never win. We setting boundaries and new customs for my kids since they used to send their dad every day, especially my son. This ain't no we argue, then we F, then we good. So basically, Cardi B is saying, like, at the end of the day, they still have a family together, but they are no longer together. But you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on all of this down in the comment section below. Because some people feel like it was a PR stunt because Cardi B is trying to release her new album. Some people felt like she needed to do something that was going to get her some attention and a lot of attention at that. But Cardi B is like, no, we're getting a divorce. This is real. We're not playing house. And this, that, and the third. But you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Subliminals and songs. I just feel as though it's hard with that whole baby mama, baby daddy thing. And especially fresh babies. And then the nerve of her to have a new one. Girl, please. Why would you do that? So anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. All right, y'all, I wasn't going to react to it, but let's get into this live with uh, Young Ten, Young Miami. Uh, the coming to court on me, lying and, and, and child support court, just depriving his child, just all kinds of things, you know, filing for primary custody, coming to court, doing my... I got to stop having sex with y'all trying to co-parent here. That's what happened. Yeah, like, Hello. but... Yeah. yeah. Keep trying to f you, then what you supposed to do? <laughs> Take them few dollars. Thank you. I don't try. No, you're supposed to say, no, this is strictly about the child because that's the problem. When it comes to uh, co parenting, if you Man, involve she up in the right that they can get that wire back. Yeah, no, that's like, it. why they're going to keep arguing because you cannot co parent. Keep watching. That's true. I learned that. You cannot. I had to learn that because it was a problem. It is a problem. At 613, Nuki, I live. I don't advise <laughs> nobody to do what I did. Try smoking. <laughs> I don't. 
I don't advise I nobody. Tell all of the baby mamas and the baby daddies on this live, you cannot have sex and co-parenting because they got in the heart. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> let the <laughs> go, let the <laughs> go. I don't care how good it is. Santana wouldn't even know. Good, <laughs> the money is. That's why he died laughing. <laughs> oh, he said both of them lying. What he's trying to say? Y'all well, lying. Say, Santana. Everybody know. Everybody know that baby daddy. Like a baby mama, and baby daddy. See, that's why. I, that's why I can't fuck with no children. Cause baby mama, baby daddy. I, hey, baby, hey. Mama, I, hey. Mama, <laughs> <Daddy, over there, laughs> Wait. Windows and all that Carisha. Stuff, you oh, dating Carisha? Mama, Carisha. you got something. Thank you. Oh. You dating Carisha? You dating? Mama, girl, yeah. Mama got the move. Yeah, Cause I just saw you at a football oh. game, girl. That nigga oh, throwing balls. Feel this not about me, girl. <laughs> 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 Feel this not about me, girl. <laughs> Feel this not about me, girl. <laughs> this about you. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> you don't got me on. No, that was hilarious. See, this ain't about me, girl. I went some interrogate me. It's your time. Is you dating? She said she dating. Good at that game, girl. I was on the jersey, all that. Like, stop trying to hide it. Don't put that new jersey on. Oh, because she had the new jersey on. Now that makes sense. Oh, oh, oh. Tell her tell yeah. tell how we do. For real, make them hoes mad. Oh, my God, man. Tia just woke it up. Yeah. It's just always in my mind. It's right, 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 right. <laughs> and if that don't stand on business, Yanti coming for his ass. Oh, I gotta put you on his ass. Great. Oh, he put a burk and all that out. He put a girl, he put a turn it up because he's like, like, oh, I forgot. He put the clothes on now. I don't <laughs> want it. He don't want this. And tell, I'm gonna hook you up with one of the friends. <laughs> Child. Oh my god, my bad. Y'all tapping the all access media girl. Let me know what y'all think. Down in the comment section below, I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey,